Are you looking to embed your job form on WordPress? Well, I'm going to show you how on this video. So follow me to my desktop right now. Welcome to Job Form. My name is George, and today I'm going to show you how to embed your form on WordPress. For this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to embed it on WordPress Gutenberg, which is the native builder from WordPress. I'm also going to show you on Elementor, which is a popular theme plugin. And also I'm going to show you on DB theme, which is also a really popular theme for WordPress. So all those three on this video. Let's get started by building a simple payment form. So let's go into create a form. And for this, we are going to use a template. So let's use a template for this and let's search for a payment form. So there are several templates available on JotForm. Just search for the one that you want to use. You can go ahead and preview it. If you like it, we can go ahead and use the template. And it's gonna load in all the elements. All we have to do now is customize it to our own, okay? Now, first of all, I am not going to set up the payment settings. This is just a demo video to embed on WordPress, but this would be a payment form that you might have. So let's go ahead and embed it on WordPress. Let's go into publish. We are going to go into platforms. We are going to search or select WordPress. Now there's two WordPress available. One is WordPress where you have the plugin installed and you use the embed code. And the other option for WordPress is actually using the script. This one doesn't need a plugin. Let's start off with this one and then we'll use the other one. So let's copy this code and let's get started with the first embed. This one is native Gutenberg, which is native with WordPress. That's what it comes with. And that's what you use for the builder. So let's go ahead and go into page. Let's go into edit this sample page. There we go. Now this will open up the builder. There we go. And if we select on this page, I'm going to add an element. So let me click enter. Here's the block. Let's click on this little plus button and we are going to search for HTML. Here we go, custom HTML. Let's go ahead and paste our code. Let's preview this. Here we go, let's scroll down here. And there we go. Our payment form is now embedded on WordPress Gutenberg. Super simple, super fast. We have the embed code, just add it and you're good to go. Um, obviously you would add it in the place where it looks really nice. Now we are getting this little red error because it hasn't been fin um, finished setting up with the payment gateway, but just ignore that for now. Okay, now let me show you how to embed it on Elementor, okay? So Elementor is a really popular plugin. Again, we are going to grab the same code. Let's go into Elementor. This is a site that has Elementor plugin. You can see it right here. And again, we are gonna go into page. Let's see all the pages. Let's edit this sample page. There we go, it just opened it up. Now, since this is the first time that I'm going to edit this page, I'm going to get this button that says edit with Elementor. If I have previously edited this, I would see Elementor in the beginning. Okay, so this is the Elementor um, builder, okay? So let's search for, again, HTML. Here we go, let's drag this wherever you want to place your form. In this case, we'll just add it here and you're gonna get this HTML code block. So in this case, we are going to add the script there. There we go and we are going to preview it. Now there's a little eye on the bottom left that we're going to click on it and we're gonna be able to preview this page. There we go, it's loading and again, you can see we've just embedded our payment form on Elementor. Super easy, right? And Let's finish off with DB Builder, another popular WordPress theme that we're going to use. Again, we're gonna grab the same script. Let's go into this side. This side has DB installed, which is a theme. And let's go into pages. Let's open up one of these sample pages. Let's go ahead and edit this one. Okay, we have the editor opened up. Um, by default, it's Gutenberg, but if we use the DV Builder, we'll click on that. It's gonna start the DV, edit with DV Builder. So same kind of process as you would with Elementor. It needs to know that you want to edit it with that, okay? We are gonna start building. Let's go ahead and wait for this. We are going to use a, use existing content, clone page. Choose pre-made up, use existing content. Okay, so we'll keep that content. 
Here we go. Now, what do we have to do? Well, let's just add in a block right here. Simple block there. And it's gonna ask us, what do we want inside of that block? Again, let's search for code. And we're gonna add our code right here. Let's go ahead and save this. And remember, there's a block right here. That's where the code is inside. And let's go ahead and preview this. Go ahead and save it. There we go. Let's go ahead and preview our sample page. So let's go ahead and open this up again. There we go. This is our sample page. There's a block. Here's the payment form already embedded on Divi. And that's how you would embed it. Now, the other way that you can embed your payment form is through the JotForm plugin. So if you have the JotForm plugin, you would grab this code right here. So this is the embed code. Let me grab this, let me install the plugin, and I'm going to show you how. So let's go into the native Gutenberg site. There we go. Let's go into plugins, add new. Let's search for JotForm. There we go. And we are going to use this one, JotForm Embed. Let's select it. Let's activate it. There we go. Now we have it activated and now it should detect the embed code from JotForm Forms. So let's go into pages. Let's go ahead and edit the same one. Okay. And let's go ahead and add a code block. Short code. There we go. Let's add the embed code and let's go ahead and preview this. And there we go. We've just embedded the payment form with the plugin. So as you can see, it's several ways that you can embed your payment form on WordPress. You can do it directly with the script code or installing the plugin. And just like that, you now know how to embed the payment form on WordPress Gutenberg, WordPress Elementor, and WordPress Divi. Well, we thank you all for watching and we'll see you on our next tutorials.